Oh yeah, Parallel Past Life here once again. Just got a quick shout out to do. Explore with Marlo C. Check out the video, some really good stuff on there. So do that, make sure you do that after this video. Once again, looking at power and past life investigations. Just a quick video again at the old farmhouse, just as a passing by. I thought I'd just check up on the place and see what's going on. I'm not going in. Just have a quick check here. Not a lot of change going on here at the moment. I'll have a look around the other side. Let's shut this back up. Try and close that back up a bit. Anyway, this is it from the outside, really, which I've not really got a lot of. Quick look round the back here. See what's what. And, uh, we'll be on again. Show you round the back. There's a window up in that corner. We thought we've seen something in that corner, but that's definitely a window through there. No strange looking objects, but that's definitely a window. We have got a strange looking object in there before, and we've also got the apparition when the window was originally shut. We've got the apparition from that window. Sorry about all the traffic noise. It's a very noisy time of the day here. Yeah. yeah, so um, <clears throat> that's that. Show you the farmhouse. And just through here, if it's still here, let's have a look. I think it's still here. Getting a bit caught up on the old. caught up on the trees, sorry about this. That's what it is. Just through here. It's a resident rabbit. We haven't got a name for this rabbit, I don't think. Anyone want to suggest a name for this little rabbit? Sorry about all the noise. Any suggestions, please? Let's get back through here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, things we have to do for you. Right. Okay. Yeah, if you've got any suggestions for that rabbit, 
leave it on the comments below give us uh, some ideas for a nice name for it I'm just going to view through here oh god that's spooky now. I think my light's going off it's not picking up very well Really um dodgy actually, oh god. Sorry it's a bit shaky, I'm trying to squeeze through the window. I'm not seeing a lot. I'm not going in anyway, I'm not getting in today. Okay. Let us know if you see anything on there. In the comments as usual. Like the video if you can. I don't see it. I don't really get a lot of likes on my video. I get enough, but not enough for the viewing sake. So if anyone views the video, can you please like the video as well? That's if you like it of course. It's all pretty much the same round here again. I am thinking about going up in there. So what do you reckon? Do you want me to go back? Not go back inside the house. Do you want me to go up and have a look in there? I could do. See what I can find up there. I'm not going in there today, but... I don't suppose there's any harm in looking, is there? Up this ladder. Our house. So I'm not going in there. One of the outbuildings, which obviously would have been a nice little cottage at some point. Lived in with the old fireplace there, but... I'll just show you Balancing on top of the ladder here, so taking a bit of a chance. I'll show you inside the house from here. There's not a lot going on in the house at the moment, so. Jesus, what was that? Bits falling down again. I might just climb here and have a look. Bear with me. Some of these old telephone things. Now bear with me, I'm just going to climb through this window. Try not to drop my bag of equipment. I'm just using my phone, so... Let's see. Want me to pick up? I might need a torch. with me for a minute. Just looking in the back. This is how I walk with doing it with one hand. Get my torch out. I'm just getting. God, I'm 
carrying some weird stuff now. I'm just getting the torch out of my bag and uh, that's something in the doorway behind me. Anyway, we'll have a look, quick look in this uh, little cottagey outbuilding next door to the main house. I like it near as well. Just hope no one takes the ladder away. God, this is so creepy in here. This is so loud. Do this on your own. And it is black in here. You can get these lights off. Tiny bit of light coming through there. This floor's dodgy as well, so I'll go too far. Yeah, look at that then. Nice hole down there. You have to be careful with stuff like this. This is likely to go through at any point, but I'm just taking a chance and see what happens there. Really. See if I can get any down there. Oh, yeah. We'll go down there and look and check out this old pram. Oh dear, the wheels are long gone from it. But look how old that is. I don't know, yeah, probably 1920s, 1930s maybe. Got a name on that, I think. Richards, that's a Richards trademark. <sighs> Anyone can tell me what year that pram had been made? I'd like to know, for just for a bit of history's sake. This whole pram here. This is madness. Contraption was. Trying to balance it and see. I don't know what that would have been. Maybe some sort of communication box of some sort. Don't know. No idea. Nice though. Nice little box, a bit rotten. Anyway. Tread carefully down here. That's just a little cubby hole. <gasps> what was that? I'm hearing noises. What was that down there? I heard a noise and I'm sure it came from down there. Definitely not in here. Right. There's a lot of dust floating around. I don't think there's any orbs. Not at the moment. That's more dust, I think. Right, I'm going to have a look down there and brave it. I'm hearing noises down here. Picking them up. Oh my god. It's worse now when I've blocked all the windows and doors up.
As I say, this is a building next door to the main farmhouse, which would have been probably been used for the workers living there on the land and doing their jobs. There's not a lot to see here, really. Whole lot is looking through area up there. It's a little bit creepy in that whole stove. Anyway, let us know if you see anything. There's a lot of dust. There might be some orbs, but I think it's maybe dust. You can see there. Old box with some advert on. Yeah, so. Have a quick look down here. Oh my god. They all painted up there. Some stuff has been moved since the last time I saw this. Jesus. Crazy stuff. Anyway. You can see that looks like a looks like an old aerial motorbike, maybe a filter cover of some sort. Not sure about motorbikes. I'm not really into them. Used to be into old cars, but not motorbikes. Could be like a engine cover, a filter cover, or something. Definitely from an aerial motorbike, anyway. Grimsby on there, which is a bit further north in Yorkshire from where I am now. So yeah, as you can see it's a bit of a sorry state in here. That's, uh, that's what we got in here. So venture back upstairs because that's the only way out. I'll just show you these spooky looking hooks at the top here. I believe it had been for like so there you've got your stairs. You've got your like these I'd say they're meat hanging hooks, I think. I don't know if you can see them. Meat hanging, drying the meat out. Maybe pheasants, rabbits, or whatever. Another tapping sound coming from in here. Coming from this wall. There's a tapping sound from here somewhere. I can hear it. I don't know if you can hear the tapping. Could be just trees on the roof or whatever. Anyway. Yeah, so let us know what you think them uh, hooks are up there. I think they're the like to dry meat out and all that, pheasants and stuff like that. But let us know in the comments what you think of them. Let us know what year you think this pram would be. Say the name on it. It's got Richard's trademark on it, so that'd be a clue to look up on Google. That's about it. A short video in here. That's it for this video anyway. Let's see if we can get back out now. Down here again. Okay. Thanks a lot for watching. Keep knocking me out off. And uh, see you on the next short video.
Later, Sparrow Naters.